Hi, we're back with Pokemon Night in the Haunted Tower. Uh, it's chapter five now. The last we left off, they got they went into the haunted tower, and some really spooky stuff started happening. So let's see where it is now. This is chapter five. It's called the Ghost Pokemon. There's no way I'm going back inside that tower, Misty cried. Me neither, Brock agreed. Ash, Misty, Brock, and Pikachu stood in the courtyard outside the tower. Ash looked at the spooky stone building. We've got to go back, Ash said. It's the only way to capture a ghost Pokemon, right, Pikachu? Pee? Pikachu grabbed Ash's ankle and hit its face. Ash knelt beside the electric Pokemon. Come on, Pikachu. Don't you want to beat Sabrina as badly as I do? Pikachu looked thoughtful. Then it nodded its head. Pika, it said in a brave voice. Then let's go, Ash said. He ran ahead. Misty and Brock didn't move. Have a nice time, Misty said nervously. We'll both be waiting for you right here, Brock added. Ash shrugged. That's fine. Pikachu and I can do this. Ash walked through the door to Pokemon Tower. Hello, everybody, Ash called out. We're back. Why don't you come out and show who you are? The room was quiet. Then a form began to suddenly appear in front of them. A purple Pokemon floated in the air. The Pokemon looked like a giant head with bulging eyes and a wide mouth. Two large clawed hands floated in the air in front of it. For a second, Ash was too stunned to move. He slowly reached for his Pokedex. What is it? He asked in a hoarse whisper. Haunter, a ghost Pokemon. No further information available, Dexter said. Haunter stared at Ash with its big eyes. It cackled. We can do this, Ash said. Pikachu, Thundershock. Pikachu stepped beside Ash. It concentrated on Haunter. Small sparks began to fly from its body. Hi! Hi. But before Pikachu could attack, Haunter vanished. Huh? Ash asked. Ash felt a tap on his shoulder. Not now, Pikachu, Ash said. We've got to find Haunter. Ash whirled around. It wasn't Pikachu at all. It was Haunter. The ghost Pokemon was inches from Ash's face. It stuck out its long pink tongue. Its eyeballs popped out of its head. There's Ash, and there's Haunter. Ash jumped back, then he composed himself. I'm not afraid of you, he said. Just wait until I capture you. Ash reached for a Pokeball in his belt, then stopped. Something was coming through the floor. Hi. It was two more Pokemon. They Hi. were floating through the floor like it wasn't there. One Pokemon was round, black, was a round black ball with two eyes and a wide mouth. A cloud of gas surrounded it. The other Pokemon was purple like the first, but it had pointy ears, arms, and legs. This is the one. He's talking about the round one. Ash pulled out Dexter. Better find out about these guys. Ghastly, a ghost Pokemon. Gengar, the evolved form of Ghastly. Dexter reported, no further information available. But how am I supposed to catch them, Ash wailed. Haunter, Ghastly, and Gengar were cackling as though they thought Ash was very funny. Gengar grabbed a rolled up newspaper. It thumped Ash on the head. This is Gengar. It thumped Ash on the head. Hey! Ash cried. Cut it out! Gengar, Gengar! The gross Pokemon laughed and laughed. Haunter and Ghastly yeah. joined in. Ash couldn't believe it. Are you guys trying to be funny? He asked. Well, I don't think there's anything funny about it. Gengar? Now large tears rolled from Gengar's eyes. Haunter! The ghost Pokemon sobbed. The three Pokemon began to sink back into the floor. Hey! 
Don't go! I've got to capture you! Ash leaped into the air. The ghost Pokemon sank into the floor and disappeared. Ooh. Ash slammed into the floor. Into the floor. Yeah. Pikachu ran to Ash's yeah. side. The vibrations from Ash's collision sent the chandelier rocking above them. It fell from the ce ceiling and landed Whoa. on Ash and Pikachu. Ash blacked out. Then he slowly opened his eyes. Yeah. Haunter, Ghastly, and Gengar were floating in the air next to them. Ash felt funny, like he was floating too. Puzzled, Ash looked down. He saw Pikachu lying on the ground. He saw another body lying on the ground too. It was his body. What's happening? Ash asked, panicked. He looked at his arms. He could see right through them. He looked at his side. Pikachu was floating in the air too. It was see-through too. Haunter, 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 the, po the ghost Pokemon explained. Oh no, Ash moaned as he realized what had happened. We've been totally separated from our bodies. Haunter grabbed Ash's arm and pulled him through the air. But I don't want to be a ghost yet, Ash yelled frantically. That's the end of chapter five.